Okay, so Jean Whaley, I do believe that she has a chance to um, retain her belt versus Joanna Jacek. But I really, um, I just believe in Joanna more. I just believe in her grit more. I just think she's been in the game longer and she's, she's um, you know, been a champ for so long. And I, I'm just envisioning her fighting Rose for the third time and how unfair that is for Rose. I still think that that's really going to happen. Now, not to take away from Wei Li, I mean, at all. She's amazing. She she definitely rose to her status very quickly. She became champ very, very quickly. She hasn't fought Rose yet. She hasn't fought... Um, well, she's fought... Let's see. She's fought... Um, what's her name? Gosh, what's her name? The Little Tornado Girl. I forget her name. Tisha Torres. Okay, she's fought her. She's really good. She's obviously beaten Jessica Andrade, right? So, obviously, she is going to be a big, big, big challenge for Joanna. Now, Joanna, I believe she has a little bit of trouble um, making her weight at 115 lately. That it hasn't been very um, good for her. But then again, she's she's gotten rid of a lot of things that ha have been distracting her, such as like a toxic... Um, relationship that she had so you know i think that joanna is gonna bring it i i feel like her last fight with rose wasn't you know like complete um dominant dominance for rose it was it was you know it was a pretty good fight um with that being said rose is the better fighter of course and i do see rose if they do fight i do see rose winning for the third time um I I really like Rose. I really see her as a true strawweight champion. Um, I just feel like she's just fantastic. I wish a lot of her interviews, though, were just by herself. I feel like every single interview is with her and her husband, Pat, Pat Barry, which, you know, no offense to him, but like... If it's a Rose Namajunas interview, we want we want to hear Rose talk, not you talk. All right, you could be there for like moral support and like chime in every so often, but like he's doing half the interview sometimes. Sometimes it's he's talking just as much as her, and it's just like it's annoying. So um, yeah, I definitely wanna wanna see this fight on Saturday. This is like the number one fight that I'm pumped up pumped up for, um, and then my second number one. My second fight that I want to see is, of course, the main event, Yoel um, versus Israel Adesanya. But I, I'm, I'm curious to, to see what Joanna does because if Joanna doesn't perform well, you know, that might be retirement for her. Who knows? That might be retirement. So it's, it's definitely going to be really interesting. Let me know in the comments who you think is going to win this fight because I, I'm, I'm kind of like all over the place in a way. Like my gut is telling me that Joanna's going to win and fight Rose for the third time. I just, I feel like that is going to happen. But then again, you know, this, this girl from China, she's just like a monster. So I mean, she could definitely, she could definitely, like, you know, if you see what she did to Jessica Andrade, she just beat her and beat her in a few seconds. So, um, yeah, I really, I really want to see, I really, really want to see this fight. So let me know in the comments. Thanks.